Amber Tamblyn says James Woods tried to pick her up when she was 16, he wanted to take us to Vegas Amber Tamblyn just got in the middle of an online spat between James Woods and Army Hammer, accusing the former of trying to pick her up when she was underage. James Woods tried to pick me and my friend up at a restaurant once, the actress, 34, wrote on Twitter Monday. He wanted to take us to Vegas. I'm 16 I said. Even better he said. Her tweet came in response to an insult Woods had hurled at Hammer's new critically acclaimed gay romance movie, Call Me By Your Name, earlier in the day. Woods later tweeted that Tamblyn was lying after responding to a Twitter user who questioned if he was in a position to criticize the age difference between Hammond's 24-year-old character and his on-screen 17-year-old boyfriend. The Twitter user wrote, what makes a 24-yo 17-yo gay relationship inherently indecent but skeevy old guys trying to pick up a pair of 16-year-old girls is okay. The first is illegal. The second is a lie, Woods responded. Earlier in the day, Woods quoted a tweet criticizing the age gap between Hammer's 24-year-old character and his 17-year-old love interest, played by Timothy Chalamet, and wrote, as they quietly chipped away the last barriers of decency, adding the hashtag of a pro-pedophilia organization. Hammer quickly responded, calling out the actor for dating 19-year-old Ashley Madison when Woods was 59 for more than six years starting in 2007. He later broke up with Madison and started dating 20-year-old Kristen Bogus in 2013 when he was 66. Hammer admitted at a Q&A after a screening at the festival that he took on the role of the grad student who falls in love with his professor's son because it made brought him out of his comfort zone. To be perfectly honest, I think the reason I took this movie and the reason I had to take this movie is that it scared me, he said. It made me uncomfortable, it challenged me, and it pushed me. I couldn't be more thankful for the experience. Call Me By Your Name is set to hit theaters November 24.